Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. My name is Dave and today we have the Rise of the Duelist box to open, to unbox and I have a huge announcement. In my next video I will make a giveaway, so subscribe to the channel if you don't want to miss that and in that specific video I will tell you how to win this box or sorry not this because I will unbox this but another Rise of the Duelist booster box absolutely unopened and uh, I will send it to the winner so so watch my next video and uh, you will know how to win a box of Rise of the Duelist. I'm really excited about because this will be my uh, first giveaway. But right now in this video let's focus on this pack and let's discuss what we can get from this. Yeah, so since uh, Eternity Code, uh, I checked out the name right now because I couldn't remember. So since Eternity Code, we, it seems like we can get really nice sets. And uh, this is the very first one in which there are no uh, cards uh, from the series. I mean, I mean, no new archetype from the series because from this, uh, Konami have a, a better better opportunity to make us uh, great cards because uh, they are not uh, restricted by the series. So I hope they can uh, they can use this advantage well. And uh, as you know, there will be no rares in this set, uh, which I, I still don't like. And uh, there are 10 different secret rares. So it will be a bit, uh, bit difficult to pull what we want, but uh, but I hope we can get one of the rare uh, spell cards. I mean, uh, among the secret rares, there are uh, three spell cards with a high value, the Nadir Servant, the three tactic talents, and uh, the forbidden droplets. So I hope we can get one of those. And right in our first pack, we have a cute Melfi. This is a new archetype. I will make a deck profile of them because they are really cute and uh, really fun to play. Okay, Galloping Gaia. Sunderhand. Okay, one of the new Dark Lord support. Dark Lords uh, have a few really great support in this set, fortunately. And we have the Infernoble Knight Emperor Charles. Okay, this is an important card for the Infernoble Knights. And uh, wow, cool artwork, cool artwork. I really like it. Okay, DD Evil, new DD support if you're interested. And Performable. And uh, the dice, the dice. Nice. I will zoom in a little bit. Okay, and let's see the next pack. Okay, okay, let's see. Uh, the new Edge Imp card for the Fluffles. They are... Uh, the Fluffles are really powerful after this set. I will show that to you also. If I will have enough time to make all the videos I would like. The Melfi Mummy. Just look at this. How cute can it be? Oh my god. Okay. Infernoble Knight, Astolfo. This is the hard ones per duel. Yeah, this is the ones per duel. Uh, Noble Knight, Infernoble Knight, Malfi Cat, cutie. Super Heavy Samurai. Okay, Link Monster. And uh, yeah, and uh, what was the. What was the. Ah. Ah, I found it, the Melfi Cat. Sorry, I just couldn't find uh, the foil card in the set. Okay. Okay, so the Melfi Cat was our foil card. It's just a super rare, but uh, from the previous we had an Ultra. So that's uh, one Ultra so far. Of course, we are... Uh, we are, would like to see the Secret Rares. Those are the most interesting cards every time. But... Uh, Ah, Dogmatica, but we still have a few cards which are not secret rares and uh, really interesting, like the the Dogmatica archetype is uh, is the new archetype, which is, okay, we have a Gaia. So, okay, I kind of like the, the new Gaia cards, but uh, I more like the Dogmatica archetype. Okay, another Gaia. Uh, that archetype, I mean, the Dogmatica is uh, quite powerful and it seems like uh, it's an absolutely meta-relevant archetype. And uh, the unfortunate fact is uh, that Konami made almost all the important cards as uh, secret rares or uh, ultra rares. Uh, so yeah, that's that's a bit unfortunate, Nemesis Keystone. 
but uh, but if you have enough money I would absolutely recommend uh, that arc type because it's absolutely meta relevant uh, yeah <laughs> the the sad story is that Konami made maybe the most important card uh, for the archetype as an ultra rare but as a short printed ultra rare so yeah that's kind of unfortunate this is a dogmatica a super rare not the best one of course yeah so as regards the ultra rares i would uh, really love to see that short printed dogmatica the the girl i can't remember the exact name but uh, that's a that's a really rare and really expensive one as an Ultra, of course. Oh, the new Mad Max support. The Amator, okay. Infernoble Knight, Captain Roland. But eventually, yeah. It's kind of cool, but I think I missed again the foil card. Ah, the Revenge Rally. Okay. I don't know, maybe it's because of the camera. Because, uh, you know, I opened these and uh, watched the the camera if uh, everything is okay and uh, sometimes I, I don't see the super rares I don't know why okay oh another dogmatica a common this time and let's see okay now this is a card I can realize that it's an ultra rare the luminous lunar dragon actually uh, this card is uh, really interesting it's a bit uh, it's a bit underrated, I think, but uh, but guys, it's so beautiful, and it also has a cool effect, so a nice ultra rare. Let's see the next one. We have a few packs uh, from the right side, and we have no secrets so far. So maybe we can get the forbidden droplet. That's the that's the most valuable card. Oh my god, the Dragon Maids. Okay. Okay, Dogmatica Punishment. Great card, by the way. The best non Ultra Dogmatica card. Non Ultra and non Secret Rare. Okay, let's see the next pack the Malfi Rabbit. The Malfi Fanny. Okay. Wow. And let's see. Yeah. It seems like I missed it again. No, this was the this was the split speed droid block and roll. Okay, I, I don't know. Maybe these are the lights, but I just can't recognize the super rares. Okay, two packs left from the right side. Let's see. Okay, another Dark Lord Sunderhand. Let's see. Soldier Gaia, the Fierce Knight. Okay, one of the new Gaia supports. Cool looking. Okay. And ah, the Heavenly Dragon Cycle. Okay, another great card for a common. And the last pack of the right side. Two ultras and no secrets so far, so they maybe they are uh, hiding on the left side. Okay, it's the pony. I think this is the cutest Murphy. Feel free to disagree with me. And let's see. Okay, Raid Raptor, Arsenal Falcon. Cool. So from the right side we had two ultra rares. And now we will start the left side. And it seems like all the secrets will be on this side. Let's see the first pack. It's just a matter of time and uh, we will find our secret rares. And then let's hope they are the ones I'm searching for. Okay, this uh, new Megalith support is uh, is also a really great one. And uh, you know Megalith is a, is a deck which can be quite powerful. Okay, this is an Ultra. The lifeless leafish. Let's see the next pack. Oh my god, what was that sound? Okay, Curse of Dragon. Cool. 
another pony. Okay, and let's see. Another soldier Gaia, the second one. Right. Oh, and an ancient warrior saga. This is the, the new support. Uh, eased by soul swings. Cool. Malfi tag and Malfi playhouse. We have a whole bunch of Malfis. I don't really mind because they are one of the cutest cards ever printed. Let's see what we have here. Another Dogmatica Nexus. Malfi, Captain Roland, Dark Lord, and. And the Reed Temible Jar. Uh, it's a little bit disgusting to tell the truth. But okay. And the commons, of course. Uh, yeah, we have a, a few Infernable Arms in this new set. They are uh, just noble arms, but uh, they are infernoble arms. Yeah, infernoble also a uh, powerful meta archetype. Maybe a little bit expensive. Okay, okay, that's a spell. Guys, that's a spell. Maybe the secret rare. Please give me a forbidden droplet, forbidden droplet. Okay. Nadir Servant! Wow! Wow, guys, look at this card. It's not the droplet, okay, but this is the second most expensive card if I remember correctly and this is one of the key cards for the Dogmatic Art type. It looks really cool. Okay, that's, that's absolutely cool, I would say that. So the first secret from our first box is uh, this one, the Servant. I hope you guys have a uh, have similarly lucky pools because this is a great one, the servant. Uh, unfortunately, you need three of this for the deck, but uh, I s but to tell the truth, two is is enough in my opinion. So yeah, okay, we have another spell, another secret right after the first one. Let's see, give me a droplet, give me a droplet. Oh, this is not a secret. Oh my god, I, I was so into a secret. But is the the new deep sea field spell. Okay, sorry, I was I was a bit overhyped. I, I thought so there will be the, the next secret rare spells. But uh, but still we have one more secret and I'm really curious what it can be. Okay, and let's see. Okay, performable Old Eyes Metal Claw. I don't know. Maybe maybe it's just me, but but it's it's kind of cool, cute for me. I would say that. Okay, and the others, DD Arc, the other DD support, Dogmatic Encounter. Yeah. All in all, this is a well-made set. I. I still don't like that it's so hard to uh, pull the, the cards you want if they are secret rare. So I don't know why there are 10 and not 8 secrets in these sets, but but this is the case now, so we have to love this. Let's see, the next one is the Speedroid Car Turbo. Okay. I, we only had 3 Ultras. That's not cool. I would like to see more Ultras. And we have only a few packs left, guys. Uh, I, I, and maybe I will start to worry. I hope we have the two secrets in this set and it's not some... Some... I, I don't know. You know there are a few sets where only one secret can be found. I hope it's not that one. Raid Raptor. Okay. What the hell? Oh, this is an ultra. Strange. Uh, okay. I don't know why, but I thought that it's only a super rare because it's not a not a really really good card. Yeah. So sorry guys. Today I I just can't see the rarities. This is this is this day. 
Okay. Oh my god, what's with this card? It's so damaged. Oh my god. Oh my god, and it was a Dogmatica card. And I think it wasn't me who damaged this card because because I just opened it as usual. Okay, let's see what we have here. Okay, the Ancient Warrior Link. Actually, this is a this is maybe the best Ancient Warrior cards, and uh, you know it's it's a Link too, so you can easily make this, and it has a cool quick effect. So, in my opinion, this is the card uh, Ancient Warriors really needed. Cool. Cool, I hope I will have the time to make another deck profile using this card and using Ancient Warriors. Okay, guys, only three, four. Only four packs left, and we have only one Secret Rare. I'm really starting to worry. Where is the next one? Where is my next Secret? Let's see. Okay, okay, there's a spell card. There's a spell card. Let's see, Forbidden Droplet. Triple Tactics Talents, guys! Triple Tactic Talents. So from one box, we had two of the rare spell cards. Oh my god. Oh my god. This is just so cool. So from one box, we have, if we see only these two cards, we have more than the price of the box back. Okay, this is this is value. This is what I said value. Cool. This is the second most expensive and this is the third most expensive card in the set if we doesn't count the starlight rares, which are uh, really really rare. Okay. What's this name? Red Time Reviver Emitter. Wow. Okay. Just a cute girl. And we have two packs left, maybe one more Ultra Rare, that would be nice. Let's see. Okay, okay. Infernoble Knight, a new one. This is our first, and uh, this is an, also an important part of the deck if you want to build it. And let's see the last pack in this box, which is... Which is a pack starting with uh, the Megalith card, okay, and let's see, we have a Melfi Puppy, and a Dogmatica Nation, this time not a damaged one, this is also a bit, okay, okay, I don't know what's happening here, so guys, uh, this is all for today, we had a few really interesting uh, cards and uh, we have a few great cards to make uh, deck profiles so I will uh, try to make a few for you and uh, as I said at the beginning of the video don't forget to subscribe to my channel and watch my next video because in that you will have the chance to win your own Rise of the Duelist booster box right from me and absolutely free including the shipping so so as always, thanks for watching guys, I hope you liked the video, and uh, stay safe, and get your game on.